All right, guys, welcome back to the Road to Super Sonic Legend series. We're on to episode number 31, and today we are Rapids with uh, <laughs> a picture of Rapids uh, in Rapids, and there's more Rapids. So I hope you're enjoying the, uh, the, the names and profile pictures so far. Uh, thank you to Aiden for the suggestion. It was over a month ago. I'm going back and checking on some old suggestions because I keep saying this. I keep seeing the same ones, and I want to make sure that I credit the person who first uh, brought it up. But we're going to be jumping into Champion 2 Division 3 on the last episode. Uh, we tried to reach a 100 win streak. If you didn't see the last episode, I won't spoil it, but you should definitely check it out and uh, see if we made it. But for today, we're Champion 2 Division 3, like I said, and we'll jump into the next games and see if we can get a Champ 3 for this episode. <laughs> Also, one last thing before we jump into the games, if you're part of the 64% of my viewers who aren't subscribed and want to help support the road to 1 million subscribers, feel free to subscribe as it helps me out a ton and you get to see more daily stupid uploads. <laughs> so let's get into the next games and see how they go. All right, we got Bazoon the Spoon and he's got a green tournament winner. Is that like the uh, the second level of tournament winner for champion? I've never seen that before. I'm going to get the mid boost here and move behind my teammate. He should have a free ball off the corner. Azuto with a good 50-50. I'll grab this boost in the corner and then try to go immediately. The guy's trying to challenge, so just beat him. I know the ball's going to come to me, so good for me to wait. It's a good situation uh, for me because the guy's going to pass it off to me. And right here, I pop it around one player. Make a shot towards target. Almost on target. There we go. Good 50-50 from my teammate. I see that one player is pretty far away. And my teammate does cut off, but it's just fine because I can see that he's in front of me. Always good to let your uh, teammate make a touch from behind. This could be a good play. He ends up missing, though. Let's try to stay near the ball though on that when the ball's rolling towards me. Tough situation for my teammate. See if he wants to go up. Okay, the, the opponent going there is not too big of a deal. Because he uh He's got a really tough angle, so I don't expect it to be on target. Obviously, if it is, it's gonna be a nice goal. And sometimes you just gotta like accept that a goal is gonna be happening. Um if it's like really, really good. You kinda wanna cover as many of the options as you can. Um, sometimes you just get caught in really bad situations though. It's a reality of Rocket League. Let's see what happens here. It's a good pass out. What I'll, what I'll do here is I'll fake that and then take the boost. Because that way I can get the ball off of him. I should have taken that mid boost as well because uh, actually he ended up landing really badly. If that guy gets another touch, it's okay. But as you can see, oops. As you can see, uh, as you can see that that's uh, not a big deal if he hits it off the backboard because it just gives, gives it right to me. Right here, I know he's going to lead it into me off that touch. So my teammate can turn. Maybe uh, make a pass off the wall. It's a decent try. It's a needs boost. One pop over one player. I think I'm allowed to jump for this <laughs> at this rank. I know I'll beat him. I just don't know if I should go um, for champ two, but I think that's fine. Teammate, the opponent kind of made a really bad turn, and right here, this could be a good chance. The opponent's kind of on it, though, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to catch it if my teammate doesn't want to touch it. He does touch it. It's not the greatest touch. Right here, I'll pop it around the one player. It's a good play uh, from the opponent, but we end up getting a good 50 50. The decent shot on target. Right here, I'm trying to watch out for the demo from behind. Right here, I'll just flick it towards net and see what happens. Nice. So right there, all I'm trying to do is a backflip uh, to get some good power. I wait for the bounce of the ball right here, and then I time it with the backflip so it goes, gets a little bit more height on it. And honestly, that was pretty savable, I think, at this level. Um, but he made a bad takeoff and then ended up flicking it in the top right corner. Right here, I have some space. It's a decent play. I could have probably made a way better flick if I held onto it a little bit longer, but... We're already up one goal. I just kind of want to chill and see what happens here. That's a good play. See if my... Mm, oh, okay. All right. Woo. Popping off. So right here, I'm going to leave that mid boost for my teammate. And right here, after that touch, I'm going to wait in mid to try and make a cutoff and see if my team wants to push up. Okay, right there, my teammate should have noticed that the guy that was coming back to defense was in front of, it, in front of him. There is no way that he's going to make it to that ball before the opponent. So right there, what you could do is drive up and then force out a touch. That's a good shot, actually. Might be on. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's a good play. Um, so what I was saying there is my teammate is trying to push up on a ball that he doesn't need to. Ends up clearing it towards the uh, the opponent, too. And I, was, I was expecting a catch, and I uh, ended up shooting it right away, which is good. Um, in those situations, usually a catch is better because I could just immediately challenge, and he'd be, he'd be like really in a bad situation. But a champ, too, obviously, he just shot it, which is actually a good thing. Right here, I could probably shoot this towards target. Make it awkward for him. It's a good touch. He makes me making a challenge. Good. Pop it off the to the side. Nothing too crazy. Teammate should be getting back now. Both players. Good. 
See if my teammate wants to go again. Not the greatest shot. It's good co uh, good coverage in the midfield. Right here, I could probably shoot this. Really good pass in midfield. I gotta cover those because uh, right there, I saw my player, my my teammate was going to be turning on that. And the second I saw that, I started creeping up. And then uh, good read, bro. Good. Sh <laughs> Thanks, man. Yeah, it's almost like I'm Super Sonic Legend. I know what I'm doing. But uh, you know, obviously he doesn't he doesn't know that. But that's the kind of reads you kind of want to be making. That's why he's like saying good re good read. And I want to, well, like I said, I want to reward really good reads. He's got a really good positioning. That's really good place uh, positioning on the ball. Right here, I'll beat this one player. At least make a good 50-50. I know I can beat him there. What a pinch. Good pass middle field. I won't, I won't score. I was going to, but I was like, no, that's, that's not that's not good. I'm We're already up a goal again. I think that like I learned from the last episode or so that I kind of need to chill. Because I'm very consistent, obviously, but I'm trying to like act inconsistent, but it's very hard for my muscle memory not to like just hit the ball properly. Let's wait in mid here, see what happens. Okay, that's fine. So he gets it off to me. I see my teammate is in front of me, so I just want to make it clear. Let him get behind me. This guy kind of passes it off into midfield. Oh. <laughs> All right. I didn't mean to do that. Um, He kind of popped it up into me. Like right here, I'm just trying to catch it. And then Nazuto kind of hit the other guy. And then the other guy got in the way, so kind of worked out. I do have all the goals, but at the same time, my teammate is actually making really, really good positioning and uh, covering the ball really well. So uh, definitely a big credit to him as well. Right here, he kind of passed it away from from uh, their possession, so I just popped it to the other side. Teammate's going out for it. Right here, I know the guy's not going to make it back too well, so I just go for a touch. And right here, I am last still until my teammate gets into net. Good try. There we go. Pop it around one. The other guy's going to be there. They both kind of go, so we have free space. Ended up bumping the player back, which is fine, but it was a good clear for my teammate to pop it down the field. Woo. Right here, I'll just go for the early 50-50 or the uh, early touch. Bounce off that corner. This is definitely open, but I'll just pop it off the side. And there we go. So, decent game. Um, my teammate definitely positioned pretty well this game. And uh, the opponents were playing pretty well, too. They were making good defensive positioning. Um, really, I just took advantage of those little moments where I could tell there was an opening for a shot like that and a bit of a poor clear from Nizudo there. And then also just receiving really good passes, just being ready for anything uh, in midfield. So just keep your your mind open and uh, yeah, eight shots. So yeah, just throwing it towards target a lot. And uh, that's kind of kind of where I got a lot of the pressure. Just, you know, finding those openings and just taking shots towards net to, to you know, pressure the opponents. So my teammate last game had really, really good passes. It was actually like better than I expected. He was he was looking for for me a lot of the time. Let's see if uh, Bandit, uh, you know, one of the names of a bot. So hopefully he's not a bot in actual gameplay. Let's we'll see how it goes. Started off with uh, an air, air dribble attempt. Ended up pinching it away from uh, away from me with that challenge from uh, Colby. But we got the corner boost. It's a good try. Right here, I'll just pop it off the wall and make it safe. I really probably shouldn't take that back corner as well, but it's okay. Pop it up to see if my teammate wants to receive it. Good play. Kind of awkward. Probably get the mid boost. Good demo there. Right there, I'll pop it towards the target. Oh. Good save. Pop off the corner again to try and pass it. Bandit's not there, so what I'll do is I'll, I'll quickly cut it and make a touch to the side. Now my teammate can have it. Good try. Ends up popping it towards the opponent, but I'm kind of ready for it in the corner here. Could have went a little bit faster too. Right here, I'm going to cover this because my teammate's rotating the net, and now we can get the corner boost. So I just covered my mistake there. Oh, oh, going for the air dribble. See, I didn't know if Bandit was going to get that corner, so I'll take it instead because the other guy was going to have it first. Good, good clear from the ball though, and my teammate gets the corner or midfield uh, boost. He'll pop off the corner. It's a little bit high for Bandit, but he's ready for it. Not great to go for the uh, the touch since he's in a bad position. Right here, I'll pop this to the side, see if my teammate can get the boost, and then take the ball. Decent pop. I see that they're going to defend it, so i got to be a little bit careful challenging those. I've talked about that a lot in the past episodes, where if the, uh, if the opponents are set up on defense, those backboards aren't really ready. You kind of want to break up their defense first before, uh, before you try to make those touches. Right, I'll take the boost from that guy and then try to make a touch here. Good clear. Teammate should be back. Good. See if he stays with it. Flick. Close. 
An immediate flick there would have probably been a goal. Uh, he tried to take control when he didn't need to. It's a good try. I know I had time to grab that ball, but my teammate kind of panicked a little bit. So what I'll, what I'll do here is just try to pressure with very low boost. Kind of go, goes over Bandit's head. He can collect it now. A common mistake I see from this uh, this level two is the uh, well, the option to go back is always there, but a lot of players don't like seem to think about that. Like they always think about. Um, okay, I don't know what's going on here. I'm a little bit scared. <laughs> um, like every time the ball comes to them, they want to immediately bring it down the field. But sometimes bring it to the field isn't like or down the field isn't the greatest option. Bit of a panic. Pop it around the players if I can. Kind of pops up pretty high. Bandit has to make the touch here. It's a good bump from the opponent. Pop it around. That's fine. Wasn't sure if my teammate would recover in time. See my teammate ahead, but I'll go for this early. If he gets a bump here, it could be really good for us. Take a shot towards target. Good save. Move back and get the mid boost now. So it's getting to the point where, like, at this rank, it's getting, like, a, a little harder to, um, you know, play slow. And you got to start to move a little bit faster and make some good shots. This is a good chance right here. Good try. So he clears it down the field. And uh, that's a good back pass. There we go. Good trust in my uh, from my teammate. Both of them commit. Now my teammate can go if he wants to pass the middle. I'm gonna wait here and try to make it obvious. It's a good save. Pop over one. Colby's gonna get the mid the corner boost. Nice bump. I have a free clear. So I'm just pop that pop that off backward. You know our good old friend backboard right there. Pop it off the corner. Johnny makes a decent touch, but it kind of makes it awkward for them. Right here, I'll pop up backward again, see if my teammate can go. And there we go. Nice one. So that was actually pretty risky for him, but he but he knew he had the confidence to go for it. I make a one touch off the backboard and then pop it off the backboard really hard. Tried to follow up for a demo as well, but misread from Colby leaves us open for a, a goal there. And this is a pretty sweaty game actually so far. The opponents are playing, playing pretty well. Get 50-50. Right here, I'll go fast, really go early because the ball's rolling towards me off that corner. Lots of time. Could have waited for the ball to roll a little bit closer to, uh, to the net, but now I'm in a 1v2, so I gotta be a little bit careful. So I'm just gonna wait here and stay with it. Right here, I'm just trying to fake them until my teammate gets back because he got demoed. Just gonna keep faking because uh, I like once I said I, once I once again I said that I wanna uh, bait bait in some time for my teammate to get back because he got demoed. So I'm playing really carefully, making sure I don't overcommit like my teammate just did. I know I could beat him on the 50-50. Pretty low here, so I don't want to be overcommitting. My teammate's going for the back corner, so I'll go get the mid boost instead. He actually uh, <laughs> actually bailed on that touch. Let's see if my teammate goes for the backboard. He's on the right side. He should be going up. He's kind of lost. That's fine, though. And the opponent ended up going. So now I'm going to try to pass this middle if I can. See if my teammate wants it. Good try. Pretty tough. The guy, the guy was covering it pretty well. So I want to make sure I uh, back off as soon as possible once I make that pass. So the play to the side. I'll just pop this towards uh, towards the net, not on target though, and see what happens with this clear. Ends up missing, and it just rolls out. So, pretty solid game there. Uh, one goal, one goal lead to make. Uh, one goal only actually to to win that game. The team was pretty consistent. Um, I would say that just a few times where he could have used his space a little a little better. Like see how he was crowding the corners, and then almost got caught out in the middle of that that uh, that play there to catch the ball. But otherwise, pretty consistent. Let's we'll see if we promote the division four. Still not yet. So maybe not in this episode. We might not make it to. Uh, Champ, uh, champ three yet. <clears throat> oh my god, I keep loading into this map <laughs> because this is a future video. Um, this is Rocket League, but it's foggy. Um, definitely uh, subscribe if you want to see that in the future. It's pretty funny. We've already recorded it, and uh, it was a blast. All right, we've got Balanced Waffle and Atomizer with Riptide. Atomizer's lower ranked, but who knows if that's like a Smurf or you know playing with a friend or something. Good 50-50. See what Atomizer does here. It's a decent hit, but it goes to the wall and. Even if he follows it, it's pretty close to the wall. Not too dangerous. So I knew I could just make it clear if I followed the ball off the wall and see if I pop that. Riptide's kind of chasing the opponent. <laughs> uh, we'll see what happens. Then I can go for this and pop it up. And I'll grab the boost as well to steal it. Oh, bit of a miss. Good finish. Nice job. So that's not on me, man. That was on the opponents just making a bad touch, bad clear. Um, Balance Waffle had a lot more time. You can see Riptide's so far away and... Balanced Waffle kind of just panicked, and there was no one. That's You just need to have that awareness to know that you have the time not to panic there. Just look around the field a little more. This could be bad here because my teammate went for the back corner, and there we go. It's a shot from uh, Atomizer. Um, in my opinion, in 2v2, cheating up is the only option. Uh, back corner leaves you open to these kind of opportunities. 
or he has a free dribble, and you never really want to give your opponents a free uh, play like that. So that's why I always cheat up. Always just sit here and get ready. Even I didn't make sure never to overcommit. That way I can get back and make a clear like this. They both crept up too, so gives us the chance to push down the field. Good play. See if uh, Atomizer has no boost here, so I'm going to grab the corner boost. Make a 50-50. My teammate should have grabbed that boost to make sure that they st we starve the waffle guy here. And I don't know what's happening here. I'm just going to back off. So I see Atomizer's low boost. So I'm just going to pop off backboard again. Wait in midfield. It's a good try. I still don't know I have pressure because they're waiting. Good try on the bumps. They're both panicking. See if Riptide wants to get in there. Good try on the 50-50. So I see Atomizer getting the boost, but he's got he's to respect my positioning. Awful's kind of in a bad spot. It's a good flick though. Teammates ready for it. Should be just shooting this. <laughs> I was going to say that is so open. They're both having like a mosh pit on the side. My teammate is carrying though. He's doing well. They bobbed each other on the side. I was like, that's definitely just open to shoot, but he wanted to take his time. You know, that's fine. That's all good. He made it work. He uh, made it happen. But I think uh, if he didn't score there, that's definitely on him. Not, not taking the opportunity when he can see that, that, uh, oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah. Um, I don't want to tell this guy, you know, obviously he should just cheat up. I'm, I'm feeding this on a platter for him. You can see how I'm feeding it to behind me, uh, to give him an opening. But, uh, you know, if he's not going to cheat up, I'm going to try and, uh, lose it pretty poorly. Uh, that's a good kill though. It should be open. My teammate almost, uh, tried to hit that ball and I think he would have messed it up. But if I'm on kickoff this time, I'm going to feed it, um, away. So he's on kickoff. So I'm going to sit, I'm going to go up and cheat. See what happens. He lo lost it pretty bad last time though. This time it's pretty good. See, it's okay if it feeds to the side because I can just go get the corner boost. That's why it's always good to keep your options open. My team makes a challenge. Good. See if I can make a shot or pass. Actually, there's a pass opportunity here. Riptide's kind of flying into the corner though. It's a decent touch backwards, but that touch right there is where I can actually finally go for it. That's the green light um, that I've talked about before. The opponent making that touch is okay. I'm just going to wait here for a shot. End up uh, being covered by the opponent. But don't have to do anything too crazy here. Good pop over one. Atomizer's gonna have a clear, so be careful. Make sure I pop it pretty hard against the wall, and I can catch it here if I just sit in the corner and wait for it. Flick it over to my teammate. Good pop off the backboard. I wanna, re I wanna reward that, but that's actually a really good play by the opponents. To make it clear. My teammate should be already back, though, and I'm gonna start, start to try and uh, demo the, uh, the opponent. It's okay if he hits that in the corner, there's not really any pressure. So wait for a balanced waffle. See what happens. Don't want to. Don't want to creep too much into the corner. Oh, my teammates uh, trying to make a play in the corner. Make a flick. Good. Just forcing up the touch. Make sure I recover pretty quickly. It's a good try there. I think my, he could have left it for me or, or made a pass over. Teammates kind of in the awkward spot, so I don't want to crowd him. There we go. Two players are out. Teammate wasn't really ready for it though, so that's okay. I'm just gonna wait behind. Kind of chill with 60 boost. Get 50 50. See if we can bump him, maybe. Just kind of waiting for an opportunity. Good save. Right here, I'm going to go back for the, the corner boost and then try to make a pop off the backboard, see what happens. Pretty close to the wall, though. I don't think my teammate should have went. Right here, it's coming out to me again, so I'm just going to feed in the, the touches. Okay, we're making, <laughs> we're making small ball here, but it's not really like good touches. Get 50 50. See if my teammate wants it. Good clear. Make a shot towards target, see what happens. Probably gonna clear it to the right side, which he does. Teammates uh, getting ready for it in mid. Oh. So let's see what he did there where he turned away and then jumped. You gotta make sure you uh, you feed your your body language into the ball before you make a touch or try to make a jump for it. Like right here, I'm touching, I'm running into it first, then jumping. I can make a touch. Right here, I'll just boost towards the ball and then back out so my teammate can make a follow up. Good try. Pop over one, atomizer backflips. It's a good pop. See, players are like pretty consistent, but it's just like a matter of uh, um, where you place the ball on your touches to make it safer. It's a good touch. I'll bump hit the other guy though, so Riptide can move up. It's a good wave dash. See if he's gonna make a touch. Yeah, okay, it's fine. I'll, t I'll turn here. Oh, good try. <laughs> good save. Right, once again, just keeping pressure, getting the corner boost. It's a good shot towards target. Good clear as well, but it feeds over to me. The way I hit this is going to smack it into the cur curve so it pops up nice and high. Then I get the mid boost. 
obviously this uh this road to super Sonic legend series is as has elevated quite quickly as you can see the the ranks up here are getting a lot faster a lot more consistent and uh overall just uh faster pace right here it's pretty close to to the opponents on the defense there should be a shot pretty dangerous i'm gonna fake it here because uh, otherwise i could have made a bad 50 50 that would lead into the opponent i grab the boost and then just wait and there we go so pretty solid games overall really sweaty games compared to the uh the last few episodes but uh the opponents are playing well and we're getting into much higher consistency and i feel like i can play more like myself as i get into these episodes but hope you guys enjoyed the series so far uh we're still division three actually we didn't even move up at all so that's crazy um but we went up about 30 points like close to 27 or something like that but until next time hope you guys have a great day and we'll catch you guys in the next one